Okay, what the Jack Johnson is going on here? I mean, is it the same song? Is it like one long song? <laughs> Hey, welcome back to the channel. I am your host and Mikado of Melody, singer Ken Levine. I am a singer and vocal coach here on YouTube. And today we are previewing, reviewing, listening to Mr. Ari Jit Singh and his performance at the Six Royal Stag Mirshi Music Awards. But before we do that, I just want to remind you, please remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a thing of all the great, awesome, <laughs> neat uh, content that we produce here on the channel every day. So without further ado, we are going to hit the play button. And here we go with Mr. Ari Jit Singh in three, two, one. <laughs> the this is a live performance. Seems like everybody knows the song. Look at that smile. I love watching performers who just love to get up in front of people and are really enjoying themselves. Is Arjit Singh, is he a classical guitarist? Because he's, he's got a, he's got a classical guitar there. medley everyone's sort of clapping in the middle of it there must be like a, a medley of his hits or something I kind of wish that this had subtitles on it an English translation that would be really helpful Okay, so I right, just a few thoughts here. There's zero pretension in this performance. It's so easy going. I feel like I'm just being enveloped by like a like an I don't know, a velvet glove or something. Just it feels like a warm hug. That's what it feels like. Okay. Kind of a hard edit there in the video. Sorry about that. I don't know what happened. Okay, yeah, this is clearly a melody, a medley of some sort, you know, a bunch of his famous songs, I guess. All in the same key, it feels like. It's actually a really good mix on this that I'm sensing you, you get a, a nice feel, like all there's nice isolation between the instruments as well as his vocal. Oh, 
जब से मिले तू से ना जब से मिले I, I can't do that like what he's doing it seems very stylistically important sorry it seems very stylistically important to this particular style the genre of music it's such a such a warm enveloping voice and i know that i've said this before but it it seems like um everyone in that room is just absolutely captivated nobody's like staring at their phone or anything like that that's uh that's cool They just keep clapping for him. Yeah, see that melismatic passage there? That's just what I'm talking about. Okay, what the Jack Johnson is going on here? I mean... They're, they all obviously know all these these songs that he's singing. Are, is it the same song? Is it like one long song, or is it a uh, some sort of uh, I don't know? Uh, I guess medley of songs. Ah uh, man, uh, <laughs> this is great. some jazz flute. Yes, clearly a medley. I think we've gotten to the bottom of that particular mystery. Like he has not stopped singing. He just keeps on going and going. Oh, now he has a little bit of a break. But uh, he just keeps on going. Tonal variation there, modulating into a different key almost, but not quite. Psych! I just want to sing along with this guy. But I won't. I won't do that to you. Did you notice that crane shot go flying in and then come flying out again? It seemed like they might have did like mix this together with a couple of other iterations or versions okay so we must be at the end now right I feel like we're sort of winding down Hey, all right. Mr. Singh is a great singer. Um, he's really got that. Someone just called me in the middle of my outro here. Okay, so all I was going to say is that there's something really interesting happening here with this particular genre of music. It's that it feels like it's imported a lot of sort of the conventions of Western style singer-songwriter conventions. Did I say conventions? I'm going to say it again. 
those sorts of conventions into and incorporating it and making something beautiful and new as a as they sort of juxtapose these these two different styles together. It was such a long medley of songs and he barely had a break, you know? And his voice, I mean, it, I don't think that he was necessarily stretching his voice to its maximum vocal capacity. It was more sort of in that easygoing, I'm just strumming my guitar at the side of the beach kind of vibe going on. And it was very, very soothing. I, 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 I dug his interpretation, I dug his voice. I think that um, this guy, there's a reason why this guy is as popular as he is. So I'm looking forward to seeing more of Mr. Arjit Singh in the future. And I look forward to seeing more of you in the future. Hey, listen, I am a vocal coach here on YouTube. If you are looking for someone to help you through some of those trouble spots in your voice, maybe a little bit of extra guidance, maybe um, to give you some pointers and point you in the right direction if you're encountering some trouble spots. Uh, I will leave a link in the description. You can contact me through there. And as always, remember to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell. It really helps out the channel and lets me know what you like and what you don't like. So if you've made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time.